Hello! My name is Kanji Coder, and I fucking hate this. Let's go. So in the illegal stuff section, we have some misspellings of some lookup tables. And then down here in Art Girl, within Shader Source Fragment Number 8, which is the bombs for Josh Shader, we have a new lookup table being injected, which is the mip map exponent, of which there are nine, converted to a lateral span in pixels, available to us for that graphical region. And then down here in the main entry point for the bombs for Josh Shader, within Label Your Units Asshole, within the Render Units, we have added the discrete internal local coordinate of the Femi tile that the sample point is over and then we have the magnitude of the femi tile in discrete units and then we don't need this because we are not stamping a 9 by 9 low resolution graphic for the femi tile we're actually using uh graphics that are in the kd7 cells okay uh next section so if we do have a femi tile we're going to try to pull out the correct texel and we've added some code here. So you can pause here to read these descriptions. For the percentage coordinate within the tile, we take the uh, discrete unit location, discrete internal location within the tile, and we divide by the number of addresses available to us, the magnitude minus one to get a percentage zero to one inclusive. For the lateral span and pixels available to us, we're gonna take the mip map exponent, convert it to the lateral span. So fem ME9 goes in and the lateral span goes out. We have to divide that lateral span by two to get the magnitude of one Femi336 graphic. We'll do more code in another video. And then uh, down here in Art Girl, uh, where we're kind of converting an array to a GLSL string, we added some more air checking. So this air checking is just to make sure that the input is a string and an array, respectively. Otherwise, we're going to fucking crash. And then down here, Shader Source Fragment Raw converted to Shader Source Fragment Preprocess. This is my preprocessor. And uh, right down here in our lookup table of arrays, we've added the new lookup table right here. In our lookup table of names, we're going to refer to it as this in the shader code, the same name that we use in the CPU side code. And then in our lookup table of tokens, this is the injection site token that our preprocessor looks for to inject the C99 equivalent of this JavaScript lookup table. We're going to increase the max index of to 40. Uh, because all these lookup tables need to uh, be the exact same length, which is the max index plus 141. And, and we're out of fucking time. We're out of fucking time. Like, subscribe, send money in the mail. You have been here. If you want a longer explanation, go to the long playlist here. Source code is here. Ways of getting a hold of me. My name is Kanji Cutter. I'm making a game engine from complete scratch. It's a fully destructible side scroller Bomberman MMO with GoldenEye style, directionally blasting proximity mines. Like, subscribe, follow.